an HDF5 dataset is the core object type where data lives inside an HDF5 file. And there are a few attributes about HDF5 datasets that are specified when they are created. Specifically, the shape of the dataset must be specified. And by shape, I mean dimensions. So think of an HDF5 dataset in the simplest terms as a NumPy array of arbitrary dimensionality. It can be one dimensional, it can be two dimensional, it can be eight dimensional. It doesn't care. You just have to specify what the shape is. So you have to specify something like, well, you know, dimension one has 800 elements, dimension two has 1200 elements, dimension three has 500 elements. And so you're now declaring, if this was your shape, you would be declaring a three dimensional data set, three dimensional array that is the shape of the data set. And then on top of that, you have to also define a data type. And these are the data, various data encoding types. The two most common ones that you'll be declaring are going to be some form of integer or some form of floating point. And HDF5 supports you know, all the different integer types. It's got you know, uint8s and int8s and int32s and everything in between. Floating point, it's mostly going to be singles and doubles. There's additional support for other types of data types, but these are the big ones that you'll that that are that you'll be primarily using with with HDF5. And that's pretty much it, right? Once you've declared these two elements, then you can lay out your data set and then put stuff into it, store values into it save down the file, and then open it back up, and then pull those files, uh, those elements back out from the data set. It's actually pretty nice. So this is the minimum aspect of a data set. Now, data sets can be much more complicated than this uh, because there are other features to them that, that HTA5 supports that allows for much more sophisticated operations, and that's why it becomes such a useful file system or file format. And we'll talk about those in the subsequent, in the subsequent videos.